So in this section, uh, we will discuss about so in the last time we In this case, what one does it? Let us say if you are having a ball, curve, right? If it rotates about ten axis, let's say this is your axis. So what will happen? Kind of hollow cylindrical. Length has right, and if this is your path, okay, so it will give you yeah. so hello. So it means that if you have to find out the moment of uh, first of all. This on what it will give you the face. It means that the total surface in this case is nothing by R, right? And your and so now let's assume that this R is the position of your right. Let us say this is Y bar. If this is y bar, the same thing will be replaced by 2 pi y bar. So, this is how basically you try to curve of revolution which gives you the surface area like this. Now, if you take a small element, let's say again the distance in this case is and uh, Let's assume that that is equals to your y, and this is your this. So what I said was, if you have to find out if you are going to revolve this small element here, so you will get the by two pi. Since it is fixed at r, so r will remain same. Y with the y and 2 pi y and your this length which is nothing but your okay so you can see that how the differential area is looking like that and similar so this is nothing but again you can add it if we have to find out the point of inertia hollow cylinder about xx axis uh, theorem so how we are going to use it this is given by small t t and this is r total length is l right the moment of inertia of this particular object or this hollow Thin and hollow cylinder is given by first of all I call this as B I. Okay, so equal I will be given by so how you are going to define this particular I is given by your R square into B M. If we are going to define BM as BM over here, when we define 
Let's try to make use of this. Yes, into thickness, R square into tan into D plus. R square T by R L. Okay. So in this case, you can see that your R is constant, right? So R square and R, so total R cube is, and obviously here this should be this is a volume. A cube by this is all will come out and it is integrated with this. So ultimately this what is is equal to C square R cube here row obviously by R cube will be P this is now if you try to what is the what is the total volume of this particular hollow uh, cylinder volume of sense volume b of this hollow cylinder is what by r mass will be M Similarly, if we are going to use this for uh, the surface of revolution, for example. Second one is the surface of evolution. So, in this case, what happens if you have a surface, right? And you are going to as such. So if you are rotating it about x x x, so what it will give you? All its cylinder. Your x x. So you are going to find this PSA. Solid cylinder. What is the formula for the solid cylinder? Uh, Moment of inertia about x axis for a solid cylinder. So I x is given by half into m. Try to get the same thing from your surface of the world. That what we will do is or try to find out the moment of inertia from surface of evolution. Let us try to correlate the volume. Okay. So what will be the volume? This rho is the density. The volume are going to object as your volume dv will be given by 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 right and what is the area? is given by that say T so or you can take this as so take 
one is small r over here and this is small strip okay dA. so this dA is nothing but when you try to rotate this group by r into this particular and if you correlate the pf this is nothing but two pi r rho so now what will be the moment of inertia of the moment of inertia about this axis r square into r square into dA represent area moment of inertia. Now if you the moment of inertia so let me let me put it in proper that when you are going to find out your i right the i so this is nothing but r square into dm r square into rho d by r over here that dm so this is what we will be getting as the Find out the total as what you have to do. No. But we are utilizing this particular So this is your higher. As your dr, this particular motion is your so this will be the pi r is from 0 to a r q RQ, right, and uh, this is what will be your it will be given by your L RQ into RQ. So, for example, if you just look at this is uh, r square, then you are having your pi r, right? So, 2 pi r into dA. Now, what you are going to have is your r cube times dA. L So D A is nothing but your pi rho. L times when you integrate this stuff, what you have L will come out. I x is given by pi rho pi now what is the volume of this solid cylinder the volume of a solid cylinder is given by pi a square into l right 
Solid cylinder your IS given by K and A square by K. How you can utilize the moment of inertia for the solid cylinder and this particular. 